What's up, guys? Welcome back. How about some uh, Namophila? Let's do it. All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Here we go. We got a request. This is uh, Namophila. This is a tour digest. Um, probably kind of going to guess it's kind of like behind the scenes and, and things like that while they're on tour. Um, this is going to be exciting for me to watch. I, I am thoroughly excited. I absolutely love Namophila. Um, I believe they're one of the top groups, if not you know the top group. Um that I've reacted to, like, you know, heavy metal or, or rock. Um, so with that, let's uh, let's dive in. Let, let's see what these lovely ladies do um, behind stage and, and before concerts and things like that. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> they even got her. I did. They had the picture of her. Yeah, <laughs> that's so awesome. That's cool. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Man, I tell you, I tell you what, for how small she is, her voice, she can, mmm. <sighs> I, I think, I think we all know how I feel about Namophila and, and Mayo and her voice, but they're all so damn incredible. They really are. Uh, Namophila is one, one of the others I want to see live. Oh, God. <laughs> it, just thinking about it would just. It, it would it would be an absolute dream. It it really would. Just thinking about how <laughs> how cute and tiny she really is, and just thinking about the 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 sound that she produces. God. <laughs> <laughs> ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
Gotta get those stretches in. いやなんだしめっちゃついてくるじゃないか<笑>あゴリラホール熱いっすね最高イエーイ I've said this before in other reactions to where I, I've reacted to, you know, groups and bands kind of um, behind the scenes or kind of like at a concert and things like that. Um, I absolutely love seeing things like this, you know, just them acting normal, you know, just like humans, just like us, um, just having fun, uh, just having fun with one another. Um, I think it's absolutely awesome to see. So with these, the stands in front of them, anytime they put their leg up on there, I call that a business decision. Because when when they do that, the shit's getting real. Um, I know I started with it. Love Bites was the one who kind of um, got my attention drawn towards it. Because they always had those stands, like, you know, when they're performing. You know, um, the, the two guitarists uh, would, you know, throw a leg up on there. And, and anytime they did that, it was go time. That there, there was some shit about to happen. Um, I also have a question: Is like I understand and I get it that bands show up, <clears throat> they show up earlier, like maybe for sound check and things like that. I'm curious to know, like, how early though? Is it like two, three, four hours before they start letting people into, you know, the venue? Um, I've, I've always wondered that as well. Um, cause I know all bands and groups and in individual singers, they have to run through all these sound checks to make sure everything is working. And I guess maybe, um, go through the list again of what they're playing. Um, I'm sure it's pre thought out. Um, as a matter of fact, I know it's all, you know, planned out on what they were going to, um, play. Um, it, it probably with the exception of, a maybe a couple, uh, sometimes that they let the crowd decide, but um, curious to, to know how long or you know how earlier they come into and onto the stage and kind of um, get a feel for it, I guess.
Look at how tiny these little venues are. Look at how packed they are. Holy shit. <laughs> that is nuts. Wow, that, that is that is crazy just how tiny this one is. Wow, okay. Oh, this one, oh, wow, this place, look at how far it goes back, but how, like, close the walls are. Wow. So, I mean, great support for them. I mean, it's it's awesome to see, you know, even with the, the small venues still being just jam-packed like this. This is crazy. That one's a little bit bigger. <laughs> All right, so that was my reaction to um, Nimble Fila's Tour Digest. Um, amazing stuff. Exactly what I wanted to see. Um, not sure what this 217.24 is, but... Um, I love all these ladies. They're they're anytime I watch them, you know the, the smiles on their faces, <clears throat> the fun that they're having. It's one thing I've always uh, enjoyed about Nemo Fela is you know their energy, the the type of energy they put off is is truly amazing, uh, infectious, infectious uh, energy. That's for sure. Um, I would I would absolutely be blessed to see these ladies live. Um, I don't know what kind of market they have here in the U S um, if they have any, um, I don't know if they've, I'm sure somebody has mentioned they traveled here before, but th these ladies need to be well known over here. They need to be cause it's criminal. If they're not, their music is just way too good. Um, not to be, it, it just, I don't know if I find out they're anywhere here in Washington, you know, anywhere near Washington state, it's go time. <laughs> Seattle, we're going, you know, anywhere near here. Um, it, it would be a dream. It, it really would be. Um, so with, with all that, I appreciate you guys watching. Um, if you're new, feel free to subscribe, like, share, comment. Um, I'm going to hop out of this one and get into the next reaction. So I will see you guys very soon. Thank you.